Um, if we were to take a look at Solana to Bitcoin first, because Bitcoin's been performing the best out of, you know, what do you call it? Uh, most of the, you know, compared to all, all, most altcoins, um, you see Solana really outpacing Bitcoin from June of 23 until March of this year, right? So for uh, almost a full calendar year, about nine months, it did extremely well against Bitcoin. And now it's literally just chopping sideways, sideways. So it seems like here, if we're going to look at this plateau right here, and then how that lines up with that area right here, I would expect Solana to hold at least above this area um, at the very, very least. I think this is like the biggest discount you're going to get on Solana versus Bitcoin, right? Um, so if it were to come down to that area, I would consider uh, you know heavily rotating from Bitcoin into Solana more. Um, uh, obviously, should you know Solana still have a, a lot of bullishness in it in terms of the market still has legs. Um, the other way you can look at this is instead of just one line, you can look at it as in a section here, or maybe up to the top of this area or the bottom of this area. If we pull that across, that lines up with the area of support here, essentially for the Solana to Bitcoin ratio. Uh, and then you just take a trend line here and you look at this downtrend. Once you break back above there and then back above this part of the ratio, which is three zeros and a two seven, Right. If Solana can make that against Bitcoin, then it starts outpacing Bitcoin again. Right. And if you get Solana outpacing Bitcoin, you probably start seeing Ethereum outpace Bitcoin. So therefore, you then want to take a look at uh, Sol versus Ethereum. Right now, right, Sol versus Ethereum is a lot stronger. It broke in this downtrend, went up for a bit, couldn't make new highs against Ethereum and failed. And it is interesting that its highs here in 21 against Ethereum are exactly where it got rejected. So that's pretty useful, interesting, right? Uh, also, if you come down to this area here, the top of this area before it really gained less against Ethereum, you probably see that area support. So you kind of got a channel to some extent here uh, of price action for Solana versus ETH. So if Solana versus ETH comes down to this 0 0.033 range, that's probably another good area to consider taking maybe some ETH and putting it towards Solana. Uh, or starting to bet on Solana. So that might not happen, like I said, until the end of July, beginning of August, um, once you have that consolidation of Solana's price against the dollar really hold. So Bitcoin and Ethereum, I would say over the next few weeks, I probably see them outpacing Solana more than not. Um, but over the next quarter or the next three to six months, I do see Solana starting to turn against ETH and Bitcoin. But first, ETH turning against Bitcoin, then Solana turning over ETH. Um, but I think the buildup it takes to get Ethereum outpacing Solana takes longer than the buildup for Ethereum to, uh, or sorry, for Solana to outpace Ethereum. I think Solana outpacing Ethereum and Bitcoin happens actually a lot faster simply because uh, easier gains in an altcoin. So I do think Solana here uh, is in a good spot. Now, just in terms of price, before we go into the ETF stuff with Solana, I do think Solana, like I said, is going to be a benchmark in this bull market. So I think it will continue to outpace ETH. I think it will continue to outpace Bitcoin more than not, should the bull market play out as we expect. Um, and so you're going to want to start taking a look at, you know, your altcoins versus Solana sometimes, not all the time, but once we get into the, I would say altcoin season, or once we get into uh, the crazy gains in this market, you're going to see, uh, you know, you're wanting to look, okay, your coin against ETH, your coin against Bitcoin, you're getting your coin against Solana. And if you're beating all three of those, then you are essentially outpacing the market with whatever coin you're in at that time. So especially if it's a main ecosystem coin, right?